We're at Allergic Stadium in Lost Wages, home of the Invaders. Hey, Grim, what's the difference between Lost Wages and China? Well, what happens in wages stays in wages. Let's play some football. Yeah, this is going to be a bloody game. The teams are loading their weapons and sharpening their spikes. The Kirkus City Creeps take on the Lost Wages Invaders. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. It's game day here on the MFL Network, and we are just about to get underway. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow, along with Brickhead Mulligan. Hi. Any thoughts on today's game? Uh, uh, hmm. uh, no, nope, not really. Kind of flatlining right now in the thoughts department. Uh, hey, can you help me get this pencil out of my ear? Uh, it's stuck worse than it was the last time. Oh, you idiot. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot. And he held on to that one for a first down. And it's first and ten. That's a gain of seven yards on the catch. Nicely done. Second and three. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 warming up. Saw bricks. Okay, he just ran into a bus saw. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot. drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And this guy is making a name for himself tonight with a pickup of about 10 on that play. Hey, he makes up a name for himself every night. That's how he stays ahead of the bounty hunters. He's wanted in 50 states. Hot one, hot two, hot He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So was that cheerleader. And that'll bring him third down in inches. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot eight. You can't keep a good mutant down. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made into dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. 
He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. Tired of the quarterback tight spiral. Now the QB has to try to run out of bounds before they get to him. Needless to say, with seven crazed defenders coming after him, that's not easy. Ah, the old quarterback shellac play. And it's first and ten. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Chunks of yards now. Nice reception for 10 yards. Second down and more than the QB would like. And he pounds the ball into the defense, picking up seven. And that'll bring up third down and seven. That's how you get your buzz on in the MFL. And I'm two fifths into this bottle of scotch. And it's first and ten. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. Third down, and, well, good luck. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. And it's first and ten. And not much there, maybe a yard. Second down and nine. Oh, and that's what they call the money shot. And it's first and ten. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. First down and five. They run it for a yard. And so at the end of the first quarter, we've got a scoreless game. Just like you love life. And that'll be second down and four. No little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Oh, and that one's...
arm's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And he picked up a lot of real estate in a hurry. Give him ten yards right there. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. Hot two, hot three. First down, and the running game opens up for them and allows the passing game to be more of a threat. Got to keep them guessing. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. Second down and long. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 And there's an eight-yard catch. Chipping away with those medium passes. I like it. Like a patient prison break. Third and two. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 First and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And they pick up nine with that catch. Uh, not enough for first, but still a nice game. And that'll bring up second and one. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. You know what they say, sometimes the best offense is... <laughs> like that walking down the sidewalk texting with his earbuds in freaked him out he said hey what'd you do that for i said i did you a lesson what lesson he said that unless you're a baboon with big baboon balls you gotta pay attention yeah along the jungle you know the defense better watch out the quarterback just threw a murder ball and he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored nicely done Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. We should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What? And kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. Straight through the uprights. Yeah. 
The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Second down in a lot. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. And that pass is good for about five yards. Third down and six. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. The defense called a sticky ball dirty trick, and the quarterback is in a show. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grin. You're right. They quickly call a timeout, hoping to save some time for their offense. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is superb, Grim. That cross pitching, unbelievable. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? And it's first and ten. The ball razors through the defense, cutting a defender in half. But that means you can wrap up the other half and save it for later. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? Well, that's two timeouts burned. And you have to wonder, Bricks, are they desperate or are they in control? Yeah, I'm speaking from experience, Grin. But it really is hard to do both at the same time. And I have mastered it. Oh, with the brain scrambler. The quarterback just used his final timeout. Let's see what they come up with on the next play. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brick's match stumpsing time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gonzalez. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it too. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry up too? First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. Oh, welcome to Fumbletown, USA. Population, this guy. Well, he should be more careful when he hurdles. And this field goal is certainly within the kicker's range. He is automatic. Nice kick. Boring. Just getting the points and let's move on. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. The brain scrambler. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. And same as Brits' ex girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit six. I... Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Frankenfood you'll have fun trying to identify. We are back for the second half as the teams line up for the kickoff. The coach told his players they'll be strung up on the goalposts if they don't make this a game in the second half. That's how you motivate these pricks.
looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. moving he picks up five on that play second down and five in football, the mighty punter. Nice punt, should move him back nicely. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. Right above these snags. Oh man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're gonna hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him, do him a favor. Finish him. And it's first and 10. And the defense jumps on sides, trying to- In some leagues, you aren't even allowed to touch the QB. In the NFL, they have plays just for killing them. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. And it's first and ten. The quarterback has had enough and calls a murder ball dirty trick to lay waste to the defense. Sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. Hey. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. Second down and two. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. And that was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. <laughs> now, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you give up points,
points. He need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, three. And that's how you run the football. A pickup of seven on the play. Grim, why is it that more mentally disturbed clowns don't play football? They'd be good. Yeah, you know, they're all in politics, apparently. Hot one, hot two, three. And he punches it, and he'll pick up the first down with a nice piece of running there. And it's first and ten. First down! He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot It's two-yard run before he stopped. <laughs> and that'll be second and eight to go. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot eight. Caught for the first down. And it's first and ten. Hot. Second down and long. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot eight. Perfect pass and a score. That's a beautiful pass for the conversion. <laughs> the teams are lined up for the kickoff. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Friends. Their marketing team hates it. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot eight. And the defense gets the quarterback for a sack. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Hot one, hot two, hot eight. A good run for five yards. Hey, didn't move the change of score, did it? How good can it be? Third down and long. He just got crushed. The third quarter has ended, and we'll need a huge rally or a high death toll to make this one interesting. You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. Oh, with a punishing hit.
And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Second down and seven. Hot one, hot two, hot three. Four yards on that one, and he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Third and four. Hot, hot one. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. And he put all of his foot into that one. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot Second down in a lot. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. You can't keep a good mutant down. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. And it's first and ten. Oh, devastating hit! You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep, third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. And he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. You think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? Well, you're mistaken, man. You get up in my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. I'm gonna wreck it. And these guys think kicking is for pussies, Bricks. They're going for two. Yeah, they got big balls, Grim. Yeah, bigger than yours. And the defense stops him cold. That play just got blown to hell. Man, it got blown to shit. Speaking of blow, where's my little pile? The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two. And that's some good old-fashioned downhill running as he picks up nine yards on the play. And that'll bring up second and one. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And he pulled out a chain shot, and now he's... <laughs> are caked in blood and guts and he's looking to score the 10 and a hard run there picks up the first down first down and three
Hey, Bricks, they're going for two here. And then a good by the number throw. And those numbers add up to two. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. It's one, two, three, and ten. And that's a nice gain of about seven yards on that run. Second and three. And that'll bring us to the two-minute warning. It's do or die now. Second and three. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot And the defense quickly calls a timeout. They want to get the ball back. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. At this point, they're going to have to get the ball back by any means necessary. Or wasting two timeouts on the defense is really going to bite them in the ass. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. You've got to catch that. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one. for a first down. No more timeouts for the defense. Or the offense, Briggs. That's, that's the important part. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, eight. Oh, great catch! And that's a touchdown! Touchdown! <laughs> Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked? And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. And that catch will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. And he picks up four on that pass and catch. Second down and six. Hot one, hot two. Eight. Oh, with the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. Hot one, eight. No, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. The Los Rangers invaders lose at home today. Poor guys. Now they gotta go home to their mansion with their pools and and try to get over this. It was close for a while, but in the end, it was just too much for them, and they couldn't get it done. Sounds like your wedding night, doesn't it? Hey, they got pills for that. You know that commercial?
commercial where they show a mummy getting a boner? What the hell are you talking about, Bricks? I don't know. I get confused often. I'm on a lot of painkillers. Well, moving right along, let's hear what the MVP has to say. Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microheart Corporation.